How many text messages would you say you send a day? Um, probably close to 500. Altrice Anderson is all about the texting. I text everybody. Um, my family's gotten to the point where they know don't call me. I won't answer my phone, just text me. And she's not alone. Everywhere you look, it's happening. Texting, Facebooking, and tweeting. From LOL to BRB to TTYL and a dozen other abbreviations in between, it's a wonder anyone communicates the good old-fashioned way anymore. It's why Queen's University communications professor, Dr. John MacArthur, says technology can be a real do when it comes to our relationships. The danger is that we lose the personal interaction that we might have otherwise if we were to see someone face to face. Since researchers say nearly 80% of all communication is nonverbal, that's a lot of ground to make up. That's why some folks we talk to like to keep texting and online communication to a minimum. There's no like sarcasm font. If you get a lot confused with tone and just what you're really trying to say. Sometimes when I'm just texting my friends, they can take things the wrong way and the message can get completely blown out of hand. And that's precisely Dr. MacArthur's point. What starts out as simple confusion really has the potential to damage our relationships. They don't get to see our face. They don't get to see our expression. And texting in moderation is great, but having primary contact, face-to-face -face contact with individuals can go a long way in developing a relationship.